You're literally broadcasting a whole new electromagnetic signature in that state. Thoughts tend to be electric and feelings tend to be magnetic. And the way we think and feel is what we broadcast into the field. And what we broadcast into the field is our experiment with destiny. So then when you go within and you disconnect from your outer world and you sit your body down and it's no longer experiencing anything and you're not thinking about your schedule, your past or your future, as I said today, you're being defined by thought and you're making your inner world more real than your outer world. When you open your eyes and you present yourself to the world, the job then is to not react emotionally to the same conditions in your life because the moment you react emotionally, you're equal to the conditions in your life and you're back in your past. Energetically, you are either choosing to create the new earth or choosing to feed the old one. It isn't just the materialized thoughts that we are concerned with. It is the frequency to which each thought is in. For example, you could be observing the state of your kitchen and either enjoying the mess as just one part of the whole or be triggered by the mess because it isn't in the state that you would prefer. I am bringing awareness to the understanding that it isn't about changing or controlling the state of reality in its material form. It's about changing your perception of the reality through harnessing the frequency of observation. Then, and only then, will the material function of your reality change, both individually and collectively.